Hello there. Hope you all are doing well. Good afternoon. So it's a Sunday afternoon today when I'm recording this. By the time you're watching this, most likely it could be a Wednesday, right? Nonetheless, so today I have a very good fragrance from a popular Indian house. It's a barber shop fragrance. Probably you might not even have heard about this house, like you know, like I did not a few days or a few weeks back. So, anyways, we've got this fragrance called as Retro from them, and we're going to talk about this particular fragrance, the performance, and what it's like to you know, kind of you know, put this on, and should you. You'll be looking at some other stuff as well from this website all right so all about it in this particular video you're watching the perfume experience my name is rodney let's start right after this intro all right so welcome back so about a month or uh, two back I have started you know uh, researching for uh, barbershop fragrances and I kind of you know picked one of the fragrances to understand what was he using because I saw him post about this particular fragrance called as Retro from the house of Captain Nemo's Shaving Supplies the website is called Nemo Shaving okay so I'll put up their details you know online so I was very inquisitive to try this because this I had not heard at all and this color cover of this blue white red you know looked very very interesting so I thought you know I should try this so after that I did do the brute video which is also barbershop fragrance and i am testing a lot of other barbershop fragrances that are uh, you know going to be reviewed soon as well right so i got this from them okay so this is a retro okay now you also see some other things we'll talk about this in a while so what is this barbershop fragrance okay so first of all uh you know for the ones who are new to barbershop fragrance so barbershop fragrances are basically old school type of fragrances that will kind of you know smell like something that you have uh, used in a shaving foam or a shaving uh, cream or a gel or an aftershave something like that right so these are things as men we would have definitely used and as women also you might have encountered at close encounters with uh, you know with your spouse or maybe you smelt it at your father or, or, or on your grandfather you will definitely would have smelt these kind of fragrances right so that is what old school uh, fragrances are so predominantly they will have some amount of citrus elements could be maybe some amount of talcum uh, like texture or aromatics like lavender uh, okay so even uh, an ink ink note the you know uh, the one that we use for writing the ink note is also quite a popular one and some woody elements like sandal you know these are certain notes that you would definitely see in most barbershop fragrances right so this particular one which is called retro so let me do one quick spray of this just to kind of you know <coughs> remember the fragrance by right so the moment you put this on you get a nice freshness of a citrusy vibe okay now it's like more lemony you know citrus that kind of a you know vibe which if i were to think about it it's also a little like a soapy kind of a fragrance okay very easily you will remember that there's a light amount of sweetness to this particular fragrance also okay and then you will also feel some kind of uh, you know spiciness that's coming that probably could be from a bay leaf you know which, which is there right the one that you use uh, <clears throat> in making biryani or anything you know taste ka patta so a bay leaf also can bring up that kind of spiciness because i kind of feel Feel that resemblance to it and I can feel a little bit of that inky vibe the one that I was talking about the ink vibe is also something that's there on this particular fragrance that I can think about it now <clears throat> when I say soapy fragrance for me this particular fragrance reminds of uh, you know the Lyril soap the green colored Lyril soap you know the girl with that uh, waterfall ad and all of that 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 is the fragrance that I kind of think of right okay so that is the uh, type of soapy vibe that I'm getting so if you're looking for a nice clean soapy uh, kind of a fragrance this could be one of that right now that fragrance when mixed with a little bit of a sweetness of the bay leaf and a little bit of that uh, uh, spicy elements that you kind of get you get a very nice freshness so the shake just now that happened on the camera is because of my cat muffin so every time i am recording is mostly here and there nowadays he sits on that table to shake anyway fair enough so let's come back so right so i was saying that you get that sweetness from the fragrance and the soapy element and that bay leaf part is something that you will get so you kind of you know enjoy that way so what i liked is that you know you don't have alcohol blast okay so but the fragrance is very very nice and it smells nice at least that's my uh, you know uh, thought about it and i wore it like three four times after i got it and i kind of you know enjoyed it that way so you know it's a nice fragrance that way now it's not a wow type of a dna it's not a dna that changes notes and all of that it's a linear type of a fragrance what you will really enjoy is that when you put this on you get a good amount of projection okay so it projects to easily about three feet plus type of a projection so that's very very good for a fragrance uh, like this second is last 
thing which I was very very surprised because easily I was getting about six to seven hours on skin and apparel okay so apparel easily about seven hours on skin I would say close to about five hours plus so which is really really good uh, for a fragrance like this okay so there is a reason why I'm saying that now when we talk about old uh, you know winter uh, or vintage barber shop type of a fragrance my wife is not a fragged okay but when i asked her how she you know what is she uh get when she smells this particular fragrance she said she can smell the soapy element part of it but she also told me something else which i did not expect while i was sitting and then you know she just randomly said you know this actually fragrance smells like a old vintage uh, you know old shaving cream that she has tried or she has you know smelled somewhere right so uh, that basically meant i was trying to figure out she said something like a boat then i thought okay maybe it's old spice type of a shaving cream so that's the type of a scent profile that somebody could resonate or you know uh, understand while smelling this particular fragrance now that is somebody who is not acquainted with fragrances at all but the very fact that her brothers or her father has used this shaving and she could instantly associate this particular fragrance to a very very old time right so that way this particular fragrance is pretty good is what i felt okay like i said it's not a wow type of a fragrance it's not a very uh, something out of the box but the very fact that it's it's nice clean soapy citrusy light sweet element okay light spiciness of that bay leaf and the inky feeling is definitely there and it's nice so how much do you get this for right so this 50 ml costs about 499 rupees okay so for that price point i think this is fantastic because if you're able to get a seven hour lasting or a six hour lasting on a fragrance like this is fabulous because uh, i have tried a few of the under 500 rupees fragrances from amazon like for example to name french essence blue for example absolutely abysmal type of performance which doesn't even last for one and a half two hours time in that category a fragrance which is 499 rupees will easily last for about six hours is is really a good job done and i think if you like bravo shop fragrances you can definitely give this a try now this one does not come in any fancy box or anything as such this comes in another uh, you know a plastic bubble uh, wrap or vacuum wrap you can say that is all that you kind of get on this particular bottle so that is how it kind of gets shipped but the fragrance is really really nice this is from the house of uh, captain nemo's shaving supplies managed by abir and uh, you know this is called as retro right now aside to this i also got a few other things which I'm yet to test. I also have two other fragrances from them. One is called um, uh, Bay Rum, which I think is basically a boozy fragrance with a little bit of a rum. And uh, then there is also Yuzu, which is also I think a alt of you, uh, Isaki Miyake's, uh, you know, uh, Isi Miyake's uh, fragrance, right? So I'm going to try those and come back to you on those. Aside to this, I also have a couple of more things that I got. One is these are aftershave supplies. So these are basically moisturizers, okay, or rather aftershave uh, creams. So, so you know they kind of are like this. It's a it's a white uh, body lotion type, which is pretty nice. I kind of use this, uh, you know, uh, the other day just to check. This is pretty nice. This has got sandalwood and oud as a combination. This damasena on the other hand has got rose and uh, you know uh, woody elements type of. This also is a similar kind of a. Uh, to shave supply but the one that i really like is this one called pirates potion okay this is really really nice this has got uh a, a bay leaf and rum and that kind of thing and this is a splash okay so this is a splash this is a uh, cream okay uh, or a body lotion type of a thing right so this is really really nice i put this on now uh, as you can see i kind of you know trim my face i tried this and this is fabulous it smells very very nice in the air and when you put it on you have a nice sweetness uh, of the fragrance you have nice uh, sweetness of the bay leaf and you have that little bit of the boozy splash and it looks very nice as well so i, I think these are also about 500 rupees each you can definitely give these also a try very nice stuff they also have shaving soaps and other things which i have not tried but these i could do a detailed review once again or do a full testing or full try of this but on the whole on the first impressions i kind of absolutely enjoyed these body uh, shave, uh, shaving uh, supplies not body shaving just shaving supplies <laughs> all right nonetheless so this is a very very good fragrance for you to try so if you like a good barbershop fragrance you can definitely give this a try especially people who like clean soapy fragrances for office use for regular use 
this is really really good so this is a retro from the house of nemo shaving which is basically captain nemo's shaving supplies you can go on to nemo shaving.in and get this from there right so this has been my review of the retro fragrance which is their barbershop fragrance and at 499 definitely good value for money especially for folks who want a nice clean soapy nice office wear kind of a fragrance with a good decent lasting about six to seven hours you can definitely try this these i will do some more testing and come back and do a full review of these of you know shaving supplies right so you're watching the perfume experience my name is rodney until another time take care bye now